Welcome to Ontology Talk. My name is Adam Pease, and I want to speak today about a fundamental concept in ontology of the notions of instances, sets, and classes. Let's look at an example of instances and classes. We can start off with the concept of human, a sentient mammal of the species Homo sapiens. Uh, that concept is a class, uh, and then we might have, let's say, three instances of this class. The set is defined by its instances. So if uh, two instances of the class uh, have a baby, there's one more instance, we have a different set. The class hasn't changed. Uh, in the same way, if one of the members of this set has an unfortunate accident and is gone, uh, we now have a different set. The class still hasn't changed. The class human hasn't changed. It's an intentional thing. It consists of its definition, not of its members. So let's take the class of uh, all female humans born on a specific date in a specific place. Uh, there might be no instances of this class, or just one. Uh, one individual, Mary, who's born on this certain date in Oshkosh, uh, Wisconsin. Uh, she's the individual, but this concept is a class. Let's also look at the notion of processes. Let's take a university lecture, for example, that might have a subprocess of thanks or acknowledgments. Uh, the process of thanking isn't a kind of lecture, uh, it's a subpart of a larger lecture. So if Richard Feynman uh, thanks Niels Bohr for his contributions to physics as part of his lecture, uh, one is a part of another, not a subclass. Here's another case that can be problematic. Let's take a look at bacteria. So we might have the subclass uh, Streptococcus. Uh, the instances uh, of this class are individual bacteria that you can point to in a microscope, uh, on, in a petri dish, let's say. Substances are another issue that are occasionally complicated. So let's say we have several glasses of water um, and maybe we take one of those glasses and we pour some of its contents uh, into uh, a fourth glass. So we now will wind up with four instances of water, four instances of the class water, and a, a particular set of uh, four bodies of water together. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, uh, please check out my website, ontologyportal.org, where there's a lot more information. Uh, if you're uh, interested, like and subscribe to the channel. And there's also a copy of my book that may be of interest to you as well. Thanks very much for watching.